Hi everyone, good morning. There's another workout uh, for today. I don't know what's today. Uh, it could be Friday. Tuesday, Thursday, whatever it is. Um, we're gonna start with the dumbbells and bands. So if you don't have bands, I'm gonna give you another exercise to do with it. But if you have it, use it, because it's gonna be a really good workout. On the first thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna start with a push-up. The push-ups, we're gonna do it on the dumbbells, it's called spider push-ups. The way I want you to do it is, you're gonna come down straight. As you're coming down, you're gonna bring your knee out completely, as high as you can. Back, and then switch to the other side. That's gonna be between 10 and 15 reps. From there, you're gonna grab your band and you're gonna have a timer, and we're gonna do 30 second splits like this. Now, if you don't have bands, you can grab your dumbbells and go outside, or if that's too heavy, just grab one and hold it for 30 seconds. The idea is to work the shoulders. We're gonna do a push and then a plank movement and then a row. So I wanna work the shoulders and the back of the shoulders. So again, you do the push-ups, 10 to 15 reps, then 30 seconds with the splits. Again, if you don't have bands, grab your dumbbells, go outside, or grab one and just hold it for 30 seconds. Then from there, we're gonna grab just one dumbbell. We're gonna do a plank, and I'm gonna go cross my body under, grab it under, switches to the other side, then turn and do it again. I want it on the elbows this time. Sometimes we'll do it on our hands too. You can do it on your hands. I like it on my elbow. It feels like it's more challenging. Then do about 10 on each side, which is 20. Grab your bands again. Another 30 seconds of this. Again, if you don't have bands, you can use dumbbells or hold one dumbbell. And then we're gonna go to a plank and row. Now we're gonna pull from that plank position. You're gonna alternate 20 times, then grab your bands, split it. Let's do four rounds of that. All right, guys, for the lower body, we're gonna do bands again. If you don't have bands, you can use dumbbells. We're gonna do 15 power squats, which is outside the men. 15 from there, timer again. You're gonna do a wall sit, keep your feet apart, and then we're gonna do splits for 30 seconds. Okay, I'm gonna get up. If you don't have bands, just grab a dumbbell, do the wall set. I'm gonna do reverse lunges, alternate, I'm gonna do 20. Remember, when you have the bands, you don't go straight back, you go a little bit to the outside, stay low. We we'll go outside. I do 20, 10 on each leg, go back to the wall set. Again, if you don't have the bands, grab a dumbbell, okay? And then we're gonna do splits, 30 seconds. And then on the last one, I'm gonna lower my bands, a little bit, and I'm gonna do back kick, keeping my back nice and straight. I'm gonna turn around this way. I don't want you to lean forward. If you lean forward, you're not gonna feel in the upper good. Push your shoulders back, nice and straight. Raise that toe back, and all you gotta do is kick back. Working on the hip, working on the glute, strictly about 50 to 20, depends on the resistance on the back. I mean, you gotta feel the burn. Don't stop if you don't feel it. Do as many as you can until you feel it. Then I go back to my wall sit, bring my bands up, and then 30 seconds, boom. And then I start all over again, we get four rounds of that. Good? From there, we're gonna go to abs. Very simple routine on the abs, but a good one too. Keep your bands where they at. You can lower down if you want a little bit. I'm gonna start with a full setup without the dog. <laughs> Sorry about that, 15 setups. Then hold it, we do 30 seconds of splits, all right? From there, I'm gonna do leg raises all the way down, all the way up. You can kick to the ceiling if you want. Then I go back to my 30 seconds. And then on the last one, you can either do bicycles, like I write it down, or you can do Russian twists. If you do bicycles with the bands, opposite elbow to your opposite knee, nice and slow, then you come up again, do your 30 seconds, do four rounds of that. We have a good routine for the upper body, good routine for the lower body. We finish with our core and stomach, and you'll be all set, all right? Enjoy, have a good workout, and I'll uh, see your faces soon, hopefully. Thank you. Bye.